Have you ever pondered the amount of Tesla stock required for retirement and a fulfilling life? If so, you are in the proper location. Make sure to watch all the way to the finish, since we'll go into great detail on this subject there. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel and leave a like. You are probably already aware of Kathy Wood's reputation as a supporter of Tesla's stock and long-term growth prospects. She has previously given the company's management team high marks for their skill in capital allocation. This includes the choice to buy back shares, which she has backed as a way to give shareholders value back and possibly raise the stock price. In actuality, Kathy Wood's investment company ARK Invest has long owned a sizable position in Tesla stock. This implies that she is quite optimistic about the company's future prospects and thinks it is well positioned to grow over the next several years. Given her prior endorsement of this tactic and her long-term bullish stance on the company, it appears likely that Kathy Wood would be supportive of Tesla's decision to engage in another repurchase. It's important to keep in mind that she has not publicly expressed her opinions on this problem, and she may have other things on her mind before deciding on a course of action. We can just about presume that her plan is to take part in this buyback. What would you do if you had the chance to purchase back Tesla stock, and how much money would you need to do that? Let's start by calculating how many Teslas you'll need to retire by 2030. Driving from a full stop will probably cost $28. If the price increases to $10,000 in 2021 from $8,000 in 2020, it is currently $12,000 in 2022. It appears that Tesla raises the cost of its FSD by $2,000 yearly. This demonstrates their confidence that if FSD materializes, which appears possible, it will be a money-making engine for them by adding $2,000 yearly until 2030, giving us $28,000 as an upfront fee, according to certain analyses. It appears that they can reach $64 by 2031, which is a known truth. If it does, Tesla will become another source of income for the man. Simply said, it's software, but it's a significant upsell, and they earn greatly from it. So by 2030, we'll keep it at $62. Vehicle and FSD sales together make up total revenue. Currently, each car sold here costs $50,000. Supply and demand have caused it to be a little bit more than that. But since we want to be cautious, we'll claim that by 2030, the typical car sold will cost $50,000. Although the accurate figure is closer to 30%, the vehicles are listed at 25%. Each vehicle sold will be worth $1.5 billion in profit shares before splits. When they announce the stock split in June, July, or October, this sum will alter. But it's all right. By 2030, they'll have 1.5 billion outstanding shares, which is improbable given that they wouldn't need to dilution so many shares with their current level of profits. If anything, they need to be paying dividends or buying back shares. Tesla, meanwhile, has stated that it is uninterested in dividends. 1.5 EPS is pre-split and follows standing shares. The EPS will change when the stock split occurs, and P was kept as close to 40 as possible. I predict that Tesla's stock price will be below 40 by 2030, and most likely above 50. In North America, the average monthly expenditure is above $5,000, or $3,000 per year for a two-person family. Let's be egotistical in this video, and suppose you wish to retire the shares one at a time. That's an entirely different tale. The typical monthly expenditure falls to just over $3,200 or $40,000 yearly. With that $3,200 monthly cost and a 3% annual inflation rate until 2030, we get at $4,020. But suppose you don't want to lead a simple existence. You want to enjoy yourself. Although the S&P 500 yields between 8% and 10% a year, we'll be prudent and say 7%. You must sell Tesla shares for almost $850,000 if you wish to withdraw $5,000 by 2030 and the S&P has an annual return of 7%. With the knowledge that the mid to late 40 seconds is an excellent moment to invest in Tesla with a predicted return of 7% and a target of $850,000, we can concentrate on our monthly expenses and how much we need to cover them. If you invest that money in the S&P 500, 
you will last up to 50 years, which is incredible. By examining the statistics, we can observe that only the food and auto sales sectors are now taken into account in our estimates. We don't currently have enough information to include Tesla's other businesses, such as robotaxis or solar panels or energy insurance. But what we do have is secure and dependable enough to support a $50,000 monthly retirement for 50 years. By 2030, you must have $850,000 in our portfolio. We just need 98 shares of Tesla stock and the worst case scenario, which would cost about $98,000 to invest to accomplish this. If the market doesn't change, this investment should generate a return of at least 7%. We may achieve worry-free retirement in just eight years by making a commitment to not squandering money, saving money, and making smart investments. In the worst situation, we require 79 shares, which would cost approximately $79,000. For those who are already invested, it's advised that you wait until the market recovers, as it always does, rather than logging in during a market crash. Assuming Tesla sells 25 million cars, our investment could generate returns of 10 times in just 8 years, or even 66 times if they sell 30 million cars. Our current forecasts solely take into account Tesla's car sales and fully autonomous FSD capabilities, leaving out additional businesses like Tesla Insurance or Solar Energy Storage. In 2019, Kathy Wood's investing company ARK Invest made a bold prediction that Tesla stock might reach a price of $4,000 per share in the next five years. This is one of the most well-known instances of significant profits from buybacks of Tesla. Their examination of Tesla's ability to rule the electric car market and other associated industries, as well as the effect of the company's stock buybacks, served as the foundation for this projection. Since then, the value of Tesla's shares has increased dramatically, and ARK Invest has profited greatly. Indeed, some reports claim that since 2017, ARK Invest's stake in Tesla has increased by more than 1,100%, with a sizable chunk of that growth coming from Tesla's buybacks. The company's stock price has also increased significantly as a result of Tesla's own buyback program. Tesla announced plans to buy back up to $5 billion in shares in 2020, and the stock price of the business has increased ever since. One of the most valuable corporations in the world, Tesla has a market capitalization of over $1 trillion as of the beginning of 2023. Overall, a major contributor to the company's expansion and success in recent years has been the effectiveness of Tesla's repurchase program and the favorable effect it has had on the company's stock price. It's critical to remember that these projections are supported by cautious estimates and hypotheses. Tesla, however, is a valued company and a leading problem solver, so we may anticipate it to last a long time and expect to retire with Tesla stocks. With prudent long-term investments and a small number of shares, we can achieve financial security and peace of mind. We appreciate you taking the time to watch this video on how much Tesla stock you need to retire and enjoy life. Long-term growth can be greatly enhanced by investing in Tesla. Additionally, a sizable portion of Tesla stock has been held by Kathy Wood's investment company, ARK Invest. While Kathy Wood's exact opinions on Tesla's repurchase plans are unknown, we may guess that, given her past support for the plan and her optimistic outlook on the firm, she may find it to be favorable. It's crucial to assess your long-term financial goals and how much you would need to retire comfortably if you were to participate in this repurchase. Having said that, always keep in mind that investing has dangers, therefore getting advice from a financial expert is essential before making any decisions about investments. Please give this video a big thumbs up and join our channel to see more thought-provoking videos like it. You'll see us in the following.